And I know, I know the arguments. I know some of you right now are thinking the same thing that I'm usually thinking. I don't have time for that, Robbie. I just don't have time for that. Real talk. If the rhythm of your life has zero margin for discipleship, you need a new rhythm of your life. I know that's the worst. But here's the deal. We cannot live with the belief that being fully surrendered to the will of Jesus will never in any way disrupt our schedule. If that is our belief, you might be slightly overestimating the divine abilities of organization and scheduling that you possess. And divine interruptions are glorious things when we have the courage and the humility to embrace them and walk in them. I promise you that God has not orchestrated your life to make it impossible to do the things that he created you, saved you, empowered you, and commanded you to do. Amen. He didn't do that. I do that to myself constantly. I constantly overcommit myself and make choices that take me out of the rhythm that he created me to walk in. He does not do that. In fact, he created this thing to work so seamlessly. He created this thing to work in such a way that when we are walking in the rhythm of being discipled and discipling others, when we understand that every aspect of our life, every detail, every avenue is an opportunity to both worship him and to disciple others to worship him, there is contentment in that and joy in that and satisfaction in that that I will never experience if I just continue to try and operate under my own schedule and what I want. That doesn't mean that his way is easy. It's incredibly difficult. Again, that's why nobody wants to do it because it's really hard. And, and, and in fact, impossible apart from his daily saturation of grace and Holy Spirit empowerment. But man, if I can, if I can step back and stop trusting in that lie from the enemy that all Jesus wants is to take from me and understand that what he is desperately trying to do is give to me, to give to you, to give you abundant life if I would just put down the dust and the ash that I insist on filling my hands with. And understand, he has created this rhythm for us to walk in.